The pictorial view of a machine part is shown in the figure. Draw the following views, front view and top view. Okay, so now see in this sum, we have a length 110, height 62 and width 45. So now we need to draw front view and top view. So first we will draw length 110, height 62 and width 45. So after drawing layout, front view, top view, we will start with front view. Now always remember, we will start with a view which has a circle. So in this case, we will take center line and we will start with this circle. So radius is how much? It is given 30. So radius will be 15. Right? Then they have given 50. See this. This to this is 50. So I can take 10. 10 on both the sides. Right? Then if you see, see how much it is going down? 10, 10 on both the sides. So you go down by 10. Go down by 10. Hmm. Then after that, if you see how much is this? 40. So we, then we need to go inside by 5, 5 on both the sides. Then if you see how much is this height, see that this is 12, right? So from bottom we can go up by 12, I can draw one horizontal line for this. Then they have, how much is this? 60. So we'll draw center line, 60. So we take 30, 30 on both the sides, right? So it would be 30, this is 50, right? Then go up by, how much is this? 12, this is 6, so go up by 6. So we are done with this lower part. Now how much is this? 22. So from center we can take 11, 11. And we can join this. So this is 11, 11 on both the sides and we can join this. Then how much is this? Radius 12. So what I can do? From here I can take 12, draw line. From here I can take 12, 12 draw line. Wherever they intersect. From that point I can draw radius 12. This will be straight. Then we have a, see this, diameter 12, 4 holes, 1, 2, 3, 4. So this thing we can draw, radius 6. So we are done with front view, except these two dotted lines. See, now we need to draw those two dotted lines. So we can mark center line. How much is that? 12. So you take 12 from here. Draw center line. And then take, how much is this diameter? 12. So you take 6, 6 on both the sides. So we are done with front view. Now we'll see top view. Now when you see from the top, you'll see this part. See this. Right? So that we will draw first. So what we will do? We will take 12. 12 from here. Draw a light line. And we can project from top. Now see how much is this? This is 23. 23 plus 12 is how much? 35. Total is 45. So 10 from here. So it will be like this. Then we can project these two lines also. And we can draw radius 12. 12. Then we have diameter 12. Then also we can draw. After that, now we need to draw a dotted line. Now when you see from the top, you won't be able to see this line. See this. 
the one which is going inside. See, this is how much? F 50. And this is 40. So we have this part, you know, 5 5 from both the sides. So that we need to draw dotted. So that will go inside. And that part is going inside by how much? 23. Right? So that we will draw. Then we have this portion also, this 22. So from center it is 11, 11, right? So from here we can, we can, we, we, we can take this directly from here or we can take 11, 11 and we'll extend dotted line. Right? So see, these two dotted lines are for this, this part. And these two dotted lines are for this part. 40. Right? Then we need to draw dotted line for this circle as well. So we'll take the center line and we'll take radius 6, 6. Right? And now there are two more dotted lines. That is for this. Now if you see this edge which is going through and through, right? See here. So that we need to draw. So we are done with front view and top view, right? You can write in that line, front view top view and we need to do dimensioning also at least you do 6 to 8 dimensions whichever you like whichever you feel it's important now one more thing if I am writing 15 over here but it is not shown so instead of writing 15, you write whatever is given to you. So you don't put calculator dimensions, you put whatever is given to you. So they have given you 30, so you write 30. They have given you 50, you write 50. Hundred and ten. Make sure you give total length, width and height. And remember that whatever I have drawn black is with a black marker that is dark. Whatever I have drawn with green marker is light and whatever is with blue is medium dark. You can draw center line. So we are done with front view and top view of this given diagram.